Good morning. Welcome back in. Well, we know that keeping a check on your health is certainly key. And for folks who spent their career playing NFL football, well, it can present a whole new set of problems. Now UAB is teaming up with a number of former players, including a Crimson Tide standout, to keep health at the top of their game plan. Here's Josh Gant. I played on every level from high school to college to the NFL. Over his career, Antonio Langham has had some memorable moments with the Crimson Tide. Like this pick six in the 1992 Iron Bowl. A week later, the hero of the first ever SEC championship game when he picked off another one. The Tide went on to win the national title. Langham went on to play seven seasons in the NFL with a handful of teams, including the Cleveland Browns and Baltimore Ravens. These days, the Bama legend lives in Birmingham and runs ACL development and real estate. And he's still in pretty good shape. What I was 175, 180 when I was playing corner in Alabama, now you can see I put on a little weight. I need to lose some weight and that's what happened. He says keeping his health at the forefront is key. Health is, is very important and sometimes that's the biggest thing we take for granted. The more you know, the more you can address at that point in time instead of waiting down the road until it's too late. Recently, Langham and more than 30 retired NFL players and their wives received free health screenings at UAB thanks to a partnership between the hospital, the Professional Athletes Foundation of the NFL Players Association, and the Living Heart Foundation. We talked to them about their physical activity levels, their nutrition, their uh, mental health. We talked to them about their sleep. Um, and other things that might uh, go into a healthier lifestyle. Dr. Asif says the conversations around mental health actually proved to be very fruitful, even if some of the retired players didn't want to talk about it at first. It was nice to see some of the wives come. Um, sometimes they gave them a little nudge about, hey, do you want to talk about this? And I'd say that that was probably the most meaningful experience for uh, many of these athletes. Mental health is, is, is a big challenge, and it was something that was needed that we saw a uh, we saw a need for it, and then they're, they're addressing it. Now, are we, well, we completely want to be with it? No, but we, we're addressing it, and, we, and we're, we're making strides with it, which is good. Langham, who is president of the Birmingham chapter of the NFL Players Association, says athletes think they're invincible, and going to the doctor may not be high on their list. He says making your health a priority is one of the keys to the game plan we call life. I want guys to continue to get regular checkups. I had guys that said they haven't had a a uh, regular checkup or feels going almost two years or better. I'm like, you, you need that every year. Langham says some of the former players actually found out a few things during these screenings that they didn't know about. So that's why he says it's important to get a regular checkup with your doctor. UAB has also been asked to do programming related to these screenings throughout the year to keep these athletes healthy. I'm Josh Kent, WBRC Fox 6 News on your side.